Hey guys, welcome to another episode in the playthrough of Hitman World of Assassination. I am going to continue the endless trial and error, unfortunately. This game, I it's still one of my favorite series, but there's I'm not really enjoying this one up till now. There's too much trial and error and waiting around, getting spotted without clear reason or at least without being able to know it up front. In the previous episode I finally had a certain guy. Ah, here is the maintenance guy. I would like to try and get this guy's uniform. But anyways, in the previous episodes, I finally had another guy uh, in a quiet area to take him out, then it was spotted. But re retrying that will just take literally 10 minutes of tailing him around, so I'm just not gonna bother anymore. There's just too much... There is just way too much... Um, Time wasted with that. I have to tail him for literally 10 minutes and then still there's a chance I get spotted when I take him out. So I will try to find another way, but that is all the trial and error that up front you just don't know what will happen. Uh, when I started tailing him to get his uniform, this guy's, I could not know that it was like a 10 minute walk. And there is so many of those instances that, that the game just, it, it takes, incre it's, it's really so time consuming and if I would have the time, if I not would have that ridiculous full-time job then I would be all for it, but I have limited time and, and then at the one point I really want to finish this playthrough. I like the series, but god damn it, it's so frustrating. Sorry, I'm really ranting, but... Here, just like this guy Can I take him out with all these people here? I'm just gonna try it anyways. Nope, and this is what I mean with trial and error. At some point you just need to take some risk because otherwise you, you just cannot get further. But it's again now three minutes wasted. Started at 45 minutes in the timer, it's now 42. It's just. Welcome to Marrakesh. And I also don't want to have a place for where I'm bitching all the time, but yeah, somehow this game makes me. And also the fact that the, the FPS is so low for a 390 RTX, a very stable otherwise PC. Um, it's crashing. Yes, sir. There's like one street here over there, 100% certain, a repeatable crash to desktop if I go there. Right, we need to get into a school building over there. Yeah, and I was thinking maybe just to use a coin to distract them, but here there are two guys, so easier said than done. Sir, are you suggesting that I represent an impressive totalitarian regime? Sir, you're not allowed to pass. Right, I do see a way here. Nice. Finally, some progress. Right, finally some progress. figure since no one knows about the escape tunnel, this is the easiest gig in town. Right, so there's some... Do is... Man, that are Shit. pretty what? big Shit. shoes, goddammit. I forgot to leave the all-access keycard in the parking garage. Are you kidding? Uh, I need to get back there before XO tears me a new one. All, all right, I'll hold down the fort. Take the tunnel, it's way faster. Yeah, yeah. All right, tunnel, that sounds good. Finally some progress, at least this is somewhat of a good start. Let's get after that guy. 
with his um, tunnel. Here we go. Let's get to that tunnel. All right. So weird green light over there. It almost seems like a texture is missing. Two guys. And there's apparently some all access key card down there. See you later dudes. So I do think the game is just really buggy. Unless How you boys up this now? green light well, is meant to be. All we gotta do is pick up Strandberg at the garage and escort him back to HQ. It the looks combatants don't know about this tunnel, so it should be a cakewalk. Almost a shame, really. To me, it, it looks like um, missing yeah. textures. Maybe hey, not. Madam, was there when the assault team brought him in? It's weird. Part of you wants to punch him in the face. Part of you wants to give him all your money. Maybe it's supposed to be fluorescent paint for uh, emergencies in the dark. But even then, it looks way too clean to me. It just looks like a bare mesh without a texture. All right, uh, at least I'm making some progress. I'm happy with that. Huh. All right, now the question is, I hide this body somewhere. We have an elite disguise, so that's good. We're making some progress finally. All right, let's assume it is not a missing texture, but I find that green color really uh, out of place. It is a little bit too prevalent and structurally present, I think, for it to be a missing texture. Oh shit. We have a guy over there. And we have a guy standing over there. And is there any way to hide bodies? Don't really see it. Just gonna take my chance here. Right, I do want to hide this body, so. Holy shit, that was a close call. That guy was back. He really could have spotted me. All right, now I'm, this is really, I'm now enjoying the game, finally, a little bit. I mean, the worlds are amazing. Frame rate is pretty okay here. Ah, fuck me, ah, okay. I was afraid that he wouldn't fit anymore, but two guys fit in there, so that's nice. All right, does he see through my disguise? So remote explosives are always handy. But now the question is, do I just walk past that guy? Will, oh. He didn't make a sound like he is um, suspicious of me. So I'm just gonna take my chance. Holy shit, but this guy, is he suspicious? No. Nope. Salute, soldier. All right, nice. My outfit is working as it should. But it can be random. Maybe this guy does spot me. No, nice. Going pretty well. No idea where I'm ending up. If I'm ending up in that embassy, that's also not what I want. 
I first want to take out the general, which was in that school building. You made it. Most impressive, 47. Now to locate Klaus Strandberg. Yeah, so this is not what we want. We are now in the... Um, in the embassy for the second target. I first want to take out that general. So let's Carry see on. if that works with this elite uniform. Previously I got spotted near the school, but I have like a regular soldier's uniform. Maybe this is better. So at least we have some uh, progress with this whole escape route thingy. Good way to get into the embassy. Right, is there anything here? He's just chilling out. None of these guys are suspicious, which is pretty nice. But now the question is, are the guys outside suspicious? Because that really can change quickly. By the way, check out how huge these shoes are. This is really like size 50. Right, I have no clue whether he will be suspicious of me. If he is, I'm screwed because probably he will walk this route and I will be, come, be spotted. Maybe he walk, will walk to the right and I can... Ah, nice, he walks to the right. Right, let's try to get near that school where the general is. And I'm gonna keep my eyes open for any suspicious, uh, suspicion sounds. But I really get the hell out of there once somebody uh, appears to be looking through my disguise. All right, this one is good. And the other guy as well. But again, there can be guys who look through me. Like this guy. This guy got me caught earlier. He's pretty relaxed. Nice. Making some good progress finally. Alright, we have a guy over there that we can take out. And what does we? It says. According to the soldiers guarding the prison cell, the condemned prisoner was a close friend of Saidan. Yeah, so uh, we already uh, read that in the previous episode. Right, this is just another way in here. So we need to get to the prison cell. Here, yeah, this is what, holy shit, that was close. That guy does, uh, is suspicious. We can actually fire uh, a gun over there. Pretty funny. Right. Was not expecting it, but I'm actually enjoying the game finally now. Messing about a bit. But the question is how to get inside school. I know that I can get a key from a headmaster in an apartment over there, but that also takes quite a bit of time. So I'm just going to try and look for an open window somewhere. Here we go. Although I didn't really see anything. Ah, here.
You are missing the necessary item, all right, whatever. Get damage. Yeah, so maybe I do need... The, I'm just going to get that key. And I'm going to stay clear of that guy. He is too suspicious. For the rest, I don't really see any way to climb up or anything. Yeah, maybe what I could try is just go in from the other side. Instead of going all the way to that headmaster, there's like a headmaster in an apartment over there who used to be the headmaster of this prison that used to be a school. And I can get um, a master key for the school. But to be honest, carry on, private. It's quite a lot of work. And now the only risk here is that again there could be one or two guys that see through my disguise, like that guy. No, he's pretty okay. Eddie, soldier. Right. This all looks pretty okay. And here's a way in. Ah, no, that's not really a way in, to be honest. Ah, maybe it is. Yeah, I do like this level, to be quite honest. Um, ah, shit, this is not a way in. only gets me where I don't really want to be near that general. Alright, let's be patient. And I did see an open window over there, so that's a way to get into the prison. Here we go. Oh, that was close. Somebody was almost spotting me. You're in. Good work, 47. Now to locate General Zaydan. 